missing message. Actually, this is the most important thing. What do we want to say? Do we have something to say? Is there a message? Giving a presentation, looking at dashboards. Dashboarding is a fashion now. Everyone wants to have these, these dashboards. And I'm, I think, to make, it, to make it clear, I think the message we have is much more important than the slides we show. If I want to tell you, I mean, dear boss, our sales went up by 5% going down to, I mean, you don't need a, a slide for this. It's much more important to get the message and not, well, this is the, actually, I call it the PowerPoint culture. People show us pictures in PowerPoint and they have to explain their PowerPoints. But you know the term, it's called a picture is worth a thousand words. It's not, it, the saying is not, use thousand words to explain your pictures. And this is PowerPoint. And this is dashboarding. I'll give you some examples. Um, we have seen this before. I just put a question mark. What does this guy want to tell us? Do we have a problem? Is it good? Is it bad? No clue. Look at this. Look at this. Look at all this stuff. You look at this and they're so proud. It looks fancy, it looks nice, but you don't understand it. No one understands it. This is the present situation. Tiles, sometimes you have these tiles, and they're only big numbers, three or four. Useless stuff. I mean, what does it help me if there is a four, five, six, sixteen point nine? This is what they have, these, these tiles. For me, absolutely useless. Useless. I mean, again, I mean, a picture is worth a thousand words. I mean, people have to explain this, explain this to us. There is no visual concept. There is no color concept. There is no meaning concept. It's just putting data looking nicely on the screen. This is the present, uh, present world. It used to be PowerPoint, and now it's dashboarding. Remember the first slide I showed you in the beginning? Uh, super dashboards in the Google picture search? Sorry, I mean, it is, I mean, there's no, not even, I think, the idea of making some kind of standards. I mean, everyone is developing his or her own <coughs> concepts. Look at this. It's just, for me, it's incredible. Just imagine you're a piano player, and you say, oh no, oh no, this is Be oh no, Beethoven. I cannot play. He has a different, different language. I only came pay Bach. And the, the, the next one says, oh no, no, I, I cannot play this because, no, he has different notation. I mean, it's, I mean, it's such a great invention that these composers, they all have the same language to communicate. And they don't discuss the beauty of the notes. They discuss the beauty of the content of the music. That's a big difference. Bach used the same boring black notes as Beethoven and his followers. They're all looking the same. There's no color and shading and all this kind of stuff. No, it's about music. And this, I think, we have to learn to come back to what we want to say and convey the message via the proper means.